What's going on there, Pisces? Uh, hope you're doing well. Gonna do a reading for you. Gonna do some future cards and some guidance for you. Yeah. If you're drawn to the saddle, then this reading might be for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see what we're gonna get. Please do hit the like and sub. That would be very much appreciated. And uh, yeah. Let's see what we're gonna get. We'll see. Pisces, near future. Near future from Pisces. All right. Page Cups, Pisces, near future. A lot of water. <laughs> yeah. Well, you are a water sand, so. Yeah. Pisces. Page of Swords. Pisces near future. Wheel of Fortune. Ooh. Mm, this might get deep. Pisces near future. Near future. Okay. I actually got two because I want to take this one too. No surprise. Yep. Yeah. Pisces, guidance from Pisces. How to deal with these energies. Nine of Wands. How does Pisces deal with these energies coming up? The Pisces, the OT's energy is coming up. Okay. Pisces, how how does Pisces deal with these energies? How does Pisces deal with these energies coming up? I feel I must take that one. All right. Bottom of the deck, we have the world card, all about cycles ending, new cycles beginning, right? So this could be an energy for you coming up in the near future, or this is an energy that you must embody. You must perhaps end a cycle here. Yes, take that as it resonates. And uh, yeah, mm -hmm. it's definitely a card that is associated with big cycles ending and beginning. The never ending story, right? Mm -hmm. So, I'll put this one, eh, put it right here. Yeah, there you go. So, first, we have the Page of Cubs. This speaks of learning about emotions. Perhaps a new emotional endeavor has come up into your life, right? Maybe you've come across somebody and uh, you're trying to get to know them or they are trying to get to know you so wanting to know more about this emotional could be a fling I, I'm not sure what it is but uh, is it, what I sense here is getting to know somebody all right so this could be coming in for you in the near future this does not have to be romantical I don't really sense a lot of romance here maybe it will go nowhere it might be, but again, I get a feeling that this might be an individual coming to your life. Um, yeah, kind of like a friend or a family member. Yeah, mm -hmm. that you either try to know them or vice versa. Might be. Further down the line, we got some rocky seas. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, this speaks of a lot of things, but I, I kind of get some turmoil here, trying to get to know this individual, right, situation. Uh, yeah, there's something here that tells me that this is not going to go super good. Yeah. Why do I feel that way about it? Because we have another page here, page of source, learning about what the deal is, what the truth is, uh, why is it not effortless? Does it make sense? 
yeah, learning about this individual, right? Um, hmm. That's why, why kind of what I feel this might not be um, love, romantic love. I sense this more to be like a colleague or, um, yeah, family member might be too. But uh, yeah, something like that. Mm -hmm. The next card, I feel real fortune is associated with ignorance to me. I'm not saying that uh, you're going to be ignorant or the other person going to be ignorant. I'm not saying that, but it could be. It definitely could. I feel there's a sort of like a rejection going on. I feel that has to do here with the Rocky Seas. Um, they don't want to know. Maybe you don't want to know. That might be too. But it's a page of swords. Right? Maybe uh, if this is you, if this is going to be you, Pisces, then uh, uh, you're going to be lear as lear learning as much as you can about this individual situation, whatever it is, and maybe you will reject it. Yeah. Maybe you will reject what you learn here. Mm -hmm. That might be. Or, like I said, could be vice versa. Further down the line, we have a choice that's going to be made based on what you find here. A choice. Either letting go or staying. I'm not sure what it might be, but it's definitely a choice that's going to be made here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's going to be a shock to the other individual situation, other people in the family maybe. I'm not sure who this is about, but it's definitely going to bring some sort of big shock. Yes, with the tower here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not, I don't think you're going to be shocked. I think you're going to be doing something that may shock them. Yeah. Yeah, which is good. That's good. Yeah, don't be afraid to do that. That's a really good thing to do. Yeah. Next card in the guidance, advice, action, swift action. So this might have to do with what you learn with the page of swords here. Maybe, well, maybe, I don't I don't think it's maybe. It's a definitely um, take action on what you find here, right? Make up your mind based on what you find. Yeah. Either you accept or reject. That's what I get here, okay? This is really a choice card. Yeah. Okay. So, but take action. Yes. Swift action. Understanding the self. Yes. Maybe you need to understand where they are coming from. If this is another individual with the Rocky Seas, right? Maybe they, I don't know, uh, their behavior may be going like, may, you may be going like with their behavior, like, wow. What is this? Who is this? Why do they act in such a way? Whatever this rocky sea is, right? Whatever the wildness is going on here, whatever that may mean, yeah. You must try to imagine yourself in their head. Yeah. Put yourself in their shoes, basically. It's what I get here with the Empress. Mm -hmm. Try to understand them, right? It's also a very much a... Um, care card to me, right? It takes care to try to understand that. It takes effort, right? That's what this card is, is all about. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Focus on that which is, and I feel has a lot, to, especially when it comes underneath the Page of Swords. Like, um, well, let me give you an example. Like, if you meet somebody and they're like, oh, I I was a, um, a burglar years ago. I did my time in jail, but now I'm out. Don't ignore this, okay? Those are red flags. That is the truth, what happens, even though they may come out for that, but still, yeah. Focus on that which is and what has occurred in the past. 
because it's likely that it may occur in the future too, okay? People change, I know, but it's something to bear in mind. So definitely when it comes out here in the tarot, you really need to focus on that which is, all right? Yeah. Don't overthink it with this individual or situation. Mm -hmm. Swiftly make up your mind with what you learn here. Reject or accept, right? Whatever you choose to do. But don't overthink it too much. If you're overthinking, I'm be fear fearful about this situation of an individual. Um, just reject it. Right, yeah, and if you want to accept it and your mind is conflicting with you, that's for a reason, okay? There's a big reason why that that is, okay? That, that's a, um, an inkling for you to perhaps reject it, whatever this may be, whatever this truth is, whatever the, these rocky seas are for. Yeah, this is like an energy of not meshing with somebody else. Yeah, and that's yeah, that's what I sense here. Yeah, it's wants the last card, a new beginning, moving on is what I sense here. It's I feel it leans towards this choice here too. Um, see this, these two card, um, two wands here. This is a choice you gotta make, right? Yeah. It seems like you must pick a path here. It seems like you're gonna pick a path. Yeah, especially if you follow this advice. Yeah. Yeah. I focus on that instead of this because this by then is gonna be in the past. And this is towards the future. Yeah. All right. Wow. That's pretty, pretty cool, Pisces. That's a pretty wild reading. Pretty rad. Yeah. There's a very rad, radical um, energy about this reading. I don't know what it is, but I, I sense a lot of yay or nay. <laughs> No in between energy. That's very, very cool. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, Pisces, do hit the like, sub, and comments. It would be very much appreciated. And see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye bye. Thank you.